Have you ever wondered what it takes to connect two countries beneath the sea? What if I told you that Europe is on the brink of unveiling one of the most ambitious underwater engineering projects in history? Welcome to the Feymarn Belt Tunnel, a groundbreaking feat set to link Denmark and Germany in ways we've never seen before. Stay tuned, because by the end of this video, you'll understand how this project is reshaping the future of transportation, and why it might just be a game changer for Europe and beyond. The Feymarn Belt Tunnel is not just any tunnel. It's an 18-kilometer submerged link connecting Radbihaven in Denmark with Puttgarden in Germany. Once completed, it will be the world's longest immersed tunnel designed for both road and rail traffic. But why build such a colossal project? This stretch of water, the Feymarn Belt, is a vital but bottlenecked trade and travel route. Currently, ferries take about 45 minutes to cross the strait. The tunnel will cut that down to just 7 minutes by train and 10 minutes by car. Imagine saving over half an hour on a trip that millions take annually. How much could that transform regional economies and connectivity? Could it potentially even inspire other countries to rethink their approach to cross-border infrastructure? Now, let's dive into how this engineering marvel is being built. Unlike traditional boring tunnels, the Feymarn Belt Tunnel uses the immersed tube method. Massive concrete sections are precast on land and then submerged into a trench dug into the seabed. Each section measures up to 217 meters and weighs 73,000 tons. To keep the tunnel secure, engineers are laying it into a specially dredged trench and covering it with gravel and protective layers to withstand pressure and erosion. The sheer precision required is staggering. But there's another layer to this story, sustainability. The construction is utilizing green energy sources and eco-friendly practices to minimize environmental impact. Denmark and Germany are even collaborating on restoring marine habitats affected by the construction. Infrastructure projects like the Feymarn Belt Tunnel aren't just about engineering, they also concern a major geopolitical standpoint. This tunnel is more than a link between Denmark and Germany. It's a bridge across the EU's political landscape. The Feymarn Belt Tunnel is a cornerstone of the European Union's Trans-European Transport Network, a bold initiative aimed at improving cross-border connectivity and reducing reliance on fossil fuels. By streamlining trade routes, the tunnel enhances Scandinavia's integration into the European market. For Germany, it strengthens ties with Nordic nations, positioning the country as a gateway for goods flowing in and out of Europe. However, the project also highlights growing disparities in Europe's infrastructure development. While Western Europe benefits from high-tech initiatives like this, Eastern Europe still struggles with outdated transportation systems. The Feymarn Belt Tunnel could set a precedent, but will it inspire equitable infrastructure development across the EU? Additionally, the tunnel bolsters Europe's position in global trade. With ports in Hamburg and Copenhagen gaining enhanced access, this project challenges Asia's dominance in logistics by streamlining the EU's internal and external trade networks. Could this tunnel mark a turning point in Europe's global competitiveness? The tunnel's impact goes far beyond travel times. It's expected to handle 19,000 cars daily, cutting carbon dioxide emissions by reducing ferry traffic boost freight transport efficiency between Scandinavia and mainland Europe, and finally, drive economic growth, creating thousands of jobs during construction and after completion. But here's the twist. While the tunnel promises efficiency and connectivity, some critics argue about its environmental trade-offs and its 7 billion euros cost. So, is the Feymarn Belt Tunnel worth the investment? No mega project is without its hurdles, and the Feymarn Belt Tunnel is no exception. Legal disputes over environmental concerns have delayed progress. Critics feared the project would disrupt marine ecosystems and local fishing industries. To address these issues, 
rigorous environmental assessments and compensatory measures have been implemented, but skepticism remains. On top of that, the logistical complexity of transporting and assembling the massive tunnel sections under the sea presents risks. Yet despite these challenges, the project remains on track for completion by 2029. So what does the future hold for the Feymarn Belta Tunnel? Beyond being an engineering wonder, this project could redefine what's possible in large-scale infrastructure. Picture a Europe where countries are seamlessly connected, not just physically, but economically and culturally. This project raises a fascinating question. Could the Feymarn Belt Tunnel set the stage for a new wave of interconnected, sustainable megaprojects across the globe? As we wrap up, the Feymarn Belt Tunnel stands as a beacon of innovation, ambition, and collaboration. It's a testament to what humanity can achieve when we dream big and work together. What do you think? Could projects like this shape the way we connect in the 21st century? If you enjoyed learning about this incredible project, make sure to check out our other videos on mega construction projects that are reshaping our world. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories of innovation and engineering brilliance.